Go over a little bit about, you know, how last week went, being your first start. I'm sure, you know, not much changes in terms of, you know, carrying the ball between starting and backup, but kind of just talk about that a little bit. Um, you know, it was nice to get the start, um, unfortunately, how it happened with, mm-hmm. with the injury to DJ. But, um, you know, I didn't feel any butterflies or anything. It was mm-hmm. the same. My family was there. They were happy for me. I was happy for myself. And uh, not the result we wanted, but, um, you know, I think it was a good first start for me and just yeah. continue to grow on that. And in, in terms of you guys going up such, against such a good rush defense and able to crack off as many yards as you did, mm-hmm. you know, how much confidence does that really build for you guys? I, I think it gives me a ton of confidence, mm-hmm. and it really uh, shows that we have a great offensive line up there mm-hmm. uh, behind Coos and mm-hmm. Martise and Jason King and Jordan Ruse and all those guys, David Hedlund. Mm-hmm. I mean, they're just a great veteran offensive line up there, and they do a heck of a job of pushing guys around because I can't mm-hmm. do what I do without those guys and without David Blau being able to make the correct read so I think it should give all of our team the entire entire offense a huge amount of confidence and now what do you do to try and uh try and harness that to, you know especially that second half confidence you know where you guys were cracking back how do you uh harness that to move it forward um with our leadership mm-hmm. and uh, I think we have great leadership on the team and they're not gonna be the type of guys that are gonna let us keep our heads down mm-hmm. um we're focused on the task ahead and that's beating Minnesota mm-hmm. on Saturday and uh I think with our leadership and our preparation out here this week, we're going to get that done. Yeah. And what does uh, what kind of challenges does that you know that Minnesota defensive line is pretty good? What challenges do they present in terms uh, of? They move a lot. Mm-hmm. They move a lot. They're really quick inside and they're physical inside, and they have some some really good tackles in the back end. Um, but we have a good scheme for them this week, and mm-hmm. uh, we'll be ready to go. All right.